How do you feel about the show? Uh, this was an A plus show. This was an A plus show. A plus. I just like thank all the crew. It's nice to have a good show. Yeah. To, to start off the tour, it's my vlog now. Such a good show. Kind of sorry I put my sweaty jacket. Is this mine or yours? It's mine. This is yours. I just took over your bunk. Yeah. I am Charles. streets of Detroit. I think we gotta call animal control. Yes, it's this cold. <laughs> or at least for a Floridian. It's like 20 something degrees. I'm wearing my annoying hat. Actually, Allie's annoying hat. Trav and I and Coley all did our little workout, so we're kicking, we're going there. We're getting there. We're gonna keep going. Side note. Undo. <laughs> yeah, I think the last time we were here, was the Simple Plan tour. I think we're pretty much doing the same route as what we did with Simple Plan. Funny, it's kind of like this whole deja vu thing. Oh, I thought you were gone. Damn it. I thought you were gone. You stepped out of nowhere. Oh, uh, show it again. <laughs> oh, here we go. Could have been the game winning. Oh, I didn't show it. <laughs> you the Patriots? Oh, uh, he's the Patriots, yeah. First time I played a video game for years. <laughs> go, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. That's game. It's funny, I completely forgot. A lot of tour videos or tour vlogs are trying to find things to do, but I've been told not to walk too far away from the venue. So I'm going to heed that warning. But yeah, we're about to go sound check and uh, get this thing going. I'm actually really, really excited. I don't really, I don't think any of us get really nervous in the sense of like that. It's more anxious. I think we just want to get out there and play. And it's going to be fun. It's going to be a good set. You guys need to come out. He officially hit me with the, where are you, daddy? I miss you. In the morning, in the morning when she was going to school and I was like, <sighs> this is the merch setup for, uh, this tour, it's the best merch we have. My guess is that one's gonna, those things are gonna sell the quickest. And probably Shrek. Juliet. Shrek, yes, Juliet. Taking memes and making it real. The perfect shirt does not exist. Yes. <laughs> Whoever made that uh, meme, come to the show, we'll give you a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for sure. Absolutely. Yeah. That's such a good idea. That's the least we can do. Yeah. Maybe more than just a shirt. We're going to have 100 people saying they need that meeting. Yeah, I was going to say, how do we prove it now? <laughs> you have to prove it to me somehow. I don't know. Let's get the metadata. Yeah. That's what we need. We are on our way to the circus. It's the Ringing Brothers. Sorry, we're in the car and this is the only light I have right now. Um, but it's much different than what it used to be in the past. So there, it's all acrobatic. There's no animals that are used in the circus. And from what I was reading, it's got a very similar feeling to, I know, they're making Cirque du Soleil. Cirque du Soleil. So it's gonna be really cool, lots of music, lots of, lots of lights. Um, but we've had a girls date night. We went to have dinner and now we're on our way to the circus right now. And we're very excited because we haven't been to the circus in, I don't even know. I don't even know if I've ever been to the I've been to the circus. Yeah. Maybe when we were really little. Really yeah, really little. But, but they had it, animals. They did have animals at that point. But no more animals. So I am very excited about going to this and to see all the changes that they made and to see what it's like. I know the little ladies back there. Are you guys excited? Yeah! So excited. Kate, are you excited? Yes! Am I excited? Yes! <laughs> First 
on the bus. This is my best, this is my favorite part of tour. And it's just me on the bus. Be nice and quiet. We don't even have the generator running because we're on shore power. Just nice and quiet, calm, just got off stage. Amazing show, amazing first day to start off a tour. Phenomenal, flawless, it was amazing. So much fun. We're just gonna go out and do the meet and greet and all that fun stuff. I'm gonna go watch Story of the Year. That's the best part, is I feel Story of the Year was my band when I was first starting to play guitar and bass and all that stuff, and just music in general. So now to, we're all just talking about that, we're all nerding out. Now that we get to actually, we're on tour with them. You know what I mean? It's like one of those things, you work hard, things happen. We're very fortunate, but that was an amazing show. Amazing show. Sorry, I'm, I look like a Smurf right now because of all the blue screens. I don't know why they're all blue. You can see me on that one. How do you feel about the show? Uh, this was an A plus show. Oh, this was an A plus show. A plus. Totally. I just like thanked all the crew. It's nice to have a good show. Yeah. To, to start off the tour, it's my vlog now. Such a good show. Kind of sorry I put my sweaty jacket. Is this mine or yours? It's mine. This is yours. I just took over your bunk. Yeah. I am Charles. It was awesome. First day of the show, like Travis was saying earlier. Thankfully, no hiccups. The only thing that happened was some AA batteries. That's it. So, knock on wood, this is not wood, that it, it continues. It's kind of, it's really nice that, you know, after so long being on a, a tour tour, that we were able to come back like that day one. Usually day one's always like a, a, a mess. Today though, was a huge adjustment and learning curve because this is day one of the tour, day two away from home. Last couple of days, Remy has been upset that I'm at home, but today really got me was because she was, I guess Ali said she was looking for me all day, but she keeps asking. And every time she kept getting on the FaceTime, she started hysterically crying. So I had to like keep telling her and showing her little Lego, I don't know if it's gonna show up because yeah, there it is. The little Lego piece that Remy made, bracelet. I kept showing her that and that actually made her feel a little bit better. Considering this is just the beginning of the tour, uh, it's it's hard. It's definitely very hard to be away from her and Allie. Because uh, like the first tour, when she was, what was it? Simple Plan. It was, she was four or five months old, so she was a sack of potatoes, so she didn't know how that she's aware of everything and she knows that I'm not there. But I'll be honest, it's really, it's, it's really killing me. It really is. It was so heartbreaking to not be able to hug her or hold her when she was like crying like that. It's just, the one that got me the most was like, you're gonna be my best friend forever. And I was just like, oh, this, 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 this sucks, this sucks. They're gonna be coming out and Allie is taking her and doing so many fun things. Today they went to the circus, which is cool that they got rid of the animal aspect of the circus. So now it's like acrobatic stuff and stunts which I think is really cool. But Allie's taking her to do all these fun things, which I'm so thankful that Allie's doing that because she's the best mom ever and she's making sure Remy is happy. You know, usually it's both of us trying to do it, but now that she's have to has to do it by herself while I go out here and do this weird job. While you're editing this, I love you. You're killing it. And Remdog doesn't watch the vlogs yet, but when you're older, Remy, I love you so much, you're amazing, and a uh, good kid, and you allowed me to do this as well. I do want to say goodnight. Uh, day one is there, and we're going next to Cleveland. But guys, there's still time to uh, get some tickets, so wethekingsmusic.com, go check that out, and all that fun stuff, and hopefully we'll see you on the road.
everyone. We are in Cleveland and I walked outside. First off, it's so funny, story of the year has the same color bus. There's little snow flurries coming down, which means it's freaking cold. Not too bad, 32. No, 37, I can't read. Today it was actually way colder. My dad, 40 years ago, he sent me a photo that they played this venue. And I'm, sent me this photo right here. 40 years ago, and now we're playing it. I need to see if the sign is still there. So you remember how I said my dad played here 40 years ago? Look at this. So they just moved the sign. So it's right there now. Kind of crazy. So the flurries are coming down a little bit more. Oh man, you can't even see it on this. Trust me, there's more. Even though it's not sticking. There you go. Now you can see it a little bit more. It's starting to stick a little bit. By that I just mean ice. Slippery, slippery ice. comes on. Uh, I feel like to say like this switch. Okay. Well, it looks cool from the outside there, well, we Cole. Got, we took a trip to see the outside of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> there you go, Seb. Sorry, Seb. <laughs> Tragic. What a bummer. Maybe next time. You should have probably looked, huh? Yeah, I don't know why I didn't look. I can't I... believe it's closed this early. Yeah. It's Saturday. Like, I figured... It goes to five. That's insane. Nine, Thursday is at nine. What a random what? day to be at <laughs> nine. <laughs> Getting ready for the show? Had a nice little detour? Sure. It was pretty cool though, wasn't it, Seb? It was great. <laughs> Told you it was all it like lived up to me? Yeah, it every expectation. <laughs> Shut the door, I can show you. Philadelphia. 
and it's always sunny here. Insert sarcasm. Oh wait, this is creepy. Wait. Yep. Okay, there we go. I'm going to try to find something to do today because yesterday I kind of was stuck in the uh, bus pretty much all day because it was incredibly cold and snowing. So that was fun. Hoping that it, it's going to be a little nice. It's actually the warmest. It was 22 in Detroit, the 29 or 30 something in Cleveland. And now it's like 32. So this is the warmest it's been. One. A little behind. One, the two, one, two, center. Behind the scenes. Hey. I love Stage that. right. The most important one. Don't forget it, uh, the Uncrustables, man. Oh. Stage left. You over here, hey. Come on, Smuckers. You got to sponsor us one day. <laughs> Philadelphia. <laughs> What's the story about this thing? We're going to go see if I can find anything. I think it's gonna happen. That's the venue we're playing. It's pretty cool looking. Looks like it's an old train station. I don't know, but it looks cool. Good morning. Are you gonna come in or are you gonna stay outside? So yesterday I was, I was in my, um, my sister. What baby, what? My sister is leaving, is leaving today or already has left for a trip. So I was helping her get a bunch of things ready. They're going to see snow. So I was trying to help her gather a lot of things and get that all done. So I kind of got a little distracted yesterday, but I hope you got to see some of the show yesterday, which was very, very cool for Charles. They've been having so much fun. Like I love seeing them back on tour because I know how much it means to the whole band and how so many of you guys go and it means so much to them. and. It's just amazing. It's just so amazing. But today, I am um, cleaning, you know, story of her life. You listen, if you own a home, you live in a place by yourself, or maybe you live with a significant other or with kids or with dogs, whatever. What am I saying? Everyone has to clean all the freaking time. But this house, I swear, my life gets dirty all the time. I'm coming and I'm making coffee! <laughs> you got it, dude! So um, today, I'm just touching up on a few things and then we are going into Remy's room. We are going to be starting our own kitchen in there. Yes, it's going to be happening. It's going to be very exciting. But I also wanted to go to this thing and it's called Vintage March. Marsh? Vintage Marsh? It's, I don't know if you guys remember, Char and I used to go to this place that was called Brew Conte and it happens like once a month, or I'm sorry, one weekend a month. And it's typically the first weekend of every month. I wanted to go and I wanted, there's a couple of different things that I want to get for the house. And I'm also probably going to go to a couple of thrift stores. So that's kind of what this is. It's kind of like a thrift store, but there's a lot of vintage things there. It's very cool. Some of them are redone. Some of them are in the same exact position or in the same exact state that they were years ago. Um, there's books, there's kids toys. I'm coming, I'm making coffee. You cook a butt? <laughs> but it's got a lot of really cool stuff, so I think we're gonna go there today. I think my mom might join us. I was wandering around because I needed to get something from Target. I stumbled upon this. This is the Edgar Allan Poe historical site. Don't know if that's his house or whatever, but it's pretty gnarly. That concludes me walking around in this cold, cold, odd. Oh, this is kind of cool. Very interesting white van. Okay, keep moving. Well, it's been a very wild and productive weekend over here. We're getting ready to lay down. Remy's just resting on the on the couch right now. I just got off the phone. Charlie's about to go on stage. It's very exciting, but Charlie's a little MIA. We had a really fun Friday. We went to the circus. Saturday, I was just helping out my sister pretty much the entire time. And today, we were running errands. Because <laughs> I have Melissa's bridal shower coming up. We were supposed to go to her house tonight, but unfortunately, it'll... hold on baby, I'm coming. I'm back. Everybody's pretty, pretty comfortable. But um, today I had to go get a few things to get prepped for Melissa's bridal shower, which is coming up very soon. So I was grabbing a couple of those things. It's just been a very a busy weekend. Um, I kind of wanted to be a lot more productive this weekend so that the rest of the time that Charles is gone, I can do 
fun stuff, you know? So um, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog or this weekend's vlog. I'm so happy Charles is on tour. I know he's been so excited to get back on tour and to start the tour vlogs again. And uh, we love you so much. <laughs>